Hey everybody, Justin here. Thank you for checking out this video. In this video, I will uh, create the Randoodle prompt for March 28th, 2023. And if you're new to Randoodle, this is a method my wife and I came up with. We take, we compiled these huge uh, lists of parts of speech. So nouns, adjectives, verbs, and so on. And then we randomly select them and put them into these, or randomly put them into these uh, structures we've created. And the challenge for you, the reader, is to draw what the prompt suggests to draw. And th these prompts can be, these drawing prompts can be super easy or super difficult. It just depends on kind of luck of the draw. But this method can easily make trillions of possible prompts and they can, because these combinations you never would have thought of, they can create really funny ones, really gross ones or silly ones. So uh, we have a book. And if you check that book out um, and leave a review, that would definitely help us out. In this book, the first page or so is we describe what uh, how we create these prompts. And the other 100 pages are just 100 prompts with room to draw for you to try these out. But what I will do in this video is you'll see a lot of prompts being randomly created up here. And after a while, I'll just settle on one that I think is interesting. And that will be the, the Randoodle prompt for today for March 28th, 2023. So let me go ahead and start uh, creating those. Okay, I'm going to stop at that one. I think that one could be interesting for a prompt. So, grinning eye lions. I have no idea what an eye lion is, but maybe you could draw something like that. So, if you uh, choose to uh, post it to social media, please use the hashtag Randoodle and we can check it out. So, I mentioned our Randoodle book. I'll also mention something you might be interested in if you like, you know, the idea of Randoodle and drawing kind of challenges or activities, art stuff. Uh, this is uh, what we call Connect and Doodle. And again, we have a book, and if you um, check it out, do leave a review. That would help us out a lot. But this is our twist on the Connect the Dots. So a, tip, a traditional Connect the Dots is the points are in a shape of a picture, and usually you already know what the picture is before you even connect the dots. Then the points are labeled 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and you connect them, and you get the picture that you already knew before you even connected the dots in most cases. Uh, we take both of those things and kind of do the opposite. So uh, first of all, our points in a connect and doodle are randomly uh, positioned on a page. And then in addition to that, uh, we thought it was boring to always have, you know, kind of mindless to always have it be one, two, three, four, five, six. So we, we create, we, the label for our points is created from a random um, skip pattern. So a skip pattern from math is like, um, counting by five, so like 5, 10, 15, 20, uh, 10, 20, 30, 40, that type of thing. So we kind of sneak some math in there. So, But the idea, the main idea with the connect and doodle is you connect the points and then you turn it into a picture. We're not giving you a picture, you turn it into one. And it could be a concrete object like a person, a, a house, a mountain, whatever, but it could also just be a random abstract art. You know, you can connect the lines curved, um, straight lines, however you want. Um, and I have a website I put together, so you don't have to buy the book. You can just check this out and 
print off as many for free as you'd like. I have this make your own connect and doodle here. And you can just create this cloud of points and print it out. And then connect those points and turn it into a picture. Okay, we also have, um, just to show you some ideas, this uh, little gallery here. And you know, you have a person, maybe a, a bird, a fish, and then some kind of abstract, um, abstract art stuff in there as well. Some doodles, line art. So that's the idea with connect and doodle. Um, but in any case, let me just recap the Rand Doodle for today for March 28th, 2023. is Grinning Eye Lions. And uh, please like and subscribe. And do share this video um, with anybody you know that might like art, art challenges, drawing, doodling, that type of thing. And that's all I got. So thank you for watching. I'll see you next video. Bye-bye.